Hey guys, this is the Card Collector, and today we are doing Thursday Mail Days. So if you don't know what that is, well, this is when I show off my weekly mail day and my local pickup. So the first local pickup, this guy was selling this. I think I picked it up only for a few dollars. Uh, that is a young gun of Luongo, so that's pretty cool. And he included this sticker, said, go and watch my channel. He had no idea who he was, who I was. He included a sticker. So if someone needs a sticker, next purchase, uh, if you say that you want a sticker, I'll give you a sticker. Yeah, a guy gave me a sticker of my own channel. He had no idea who I was. Perfect. So next we got a package. I don't know what this is. Should be, hopefully... I don't really know what some of this stuff is that I buy. I know what this is. Actually, I can already tell you what it is. This is a purchase I did. And it's because, well, I didn't re even really remember buying this. But I did pick up. That is an Artemi Panarin. Young Gun. Out, or N PSA. I think I picked it up pretty cheap, hopefully. That is a six. Kind of bad, but that's okay. He included, looks like a Shea Weber insert. A canvas that uh, may or may not be ripped. A Josh, what is that? Josh Hardening. Jamie Benn. Leonard. Dwight King. This is that Steven Stamkos highlights insert? A lot of cool stuff. This is what 1819 series one. I did buy some series one to open on this channel. Montour, Aho base. Oh, tapes on here. We got a Rudlov, Cody Eakin, a piece of tape, and or an Andy Green. And a Carl Soderberg. Awesome. So thank you. I can't remember the guy's name that uh, sent this, but thank you for that package. Next. Uh, hopefully this is what I think it is. And no, this is a package from Quebec. All right, let's see what we got here. Got a Cody Glass out of 399. Got a Jake Vertanen Young Gun. Vertanen, decent player. Sam Steele Young Gun. Brandstrom. Cap or uh, Casper Capitan. Don't remember buying that. A clear cut of Matthews. And an Ethan Bear Young Gun. So that's from Instagram. There should be another package from him, hopefully. This is a PC card. I peeled off the label. Let's uh, get into this. And hopefully the card, yes, that looks good. Beautiful card. If you don't know what this is, I did a trade for it about a month or so ago. Finally got to them. And take the time, guys. Hit that subscribe button and hit that like button. Hopefully uh, this week, Artifacts is hopefully going to be Friday. Fingers crossed for Friday. If not, it's going to be Tuesday. It's coming all the way from Kelowna. So there we go. We got for the PC, we got a Kako rookie auto. So that is hard signed out of 199. These cards are really, really hard to get. It's Panini, so I don't know if it is classified as a rookie, but you can see no NHL. But they do have side or they do have side numbers, not like Lafreniere, but very nice for the collection. This, I have no idea. Hopefully, it is not the card I'm waiting for. If it is, I'm going to be very upset. All right. And it is the card I'm waiting for. Oh, don't let this be damaged. I don't know why he would send it. First, we've got a very nice set of Gucci Taves checklist. Condition's pretty good. And we got a Taves Young Gun sent in a plain white envelope. So we bought it pretty cheap because the top has chipping. Got it out of the pack like that. It was actually from a break on 
I think uh, Facebook, and it was pulled like that. I made an offer, he accepted. All the uh, major young guns are going up. Next package we got from Player's Choice. I know what this is. This is not hockey, but it should be something that I've been waiting for for a while. That's where I bought my artifacts box. If you guys go, Player's Choice. I think they were selling for 150 or 160 plus shipping plus taxes. There it is. Go and check them out. And this is, if I remember correctly, that is a Beckett graded Kenny Omega. If you guys aren't wrestling fans, that's okay. I just wanted an autograph slab for the collection. Eight, 8.5, pretty bad. I have to go and actually take a look at it. Service must be scratched or the corners or something. That corner at the bottom is pretty bad. But if you're a wrestling fan, everybody knows that Omega is one of the best. We'll put this back in here and we'll go on to the next package. Beautiful. And one more time, player's choice. There you go, from Kelowna. That's where I buy some of my boxes from. If my shop can get any or if I'm not, or if I'm stupid and don't order from my shop and it sells out that's where i go it and if not that i go to zephyr epic all right so this is oh this is the card i was waiting for too nice card i'm gonna send to psa hopefully well i have to get their stuff sorted out kirby dock future watch on 999 pretty nice only thing is that little we now looking at it, it looks like someone ran something across it. it. Looks like some. It's not paint. I don't know what that is. It's and usually if there is uh, a paint or something, they don't put it on the card. I don't know what that is, but I'm gonna send a PSA anyways. If it gets a nine, it gets a nine. I maybe. I am not 100% sure if I'm gonna send that yet. It's like the worst. It's like the worst knife ever. Next, this is the package number two. And there's a lot of stuff in here. I've been waiting for this package for probably close to a month and a half. Thomas Harley, clear cut, young gun. One of the best players I can say on Team Canada. That's just my opinion. When no one, when they were against the United States and no one really, they were down what it was, two nothing. Thomas Harley stopped a lot of shots. We got a Pedersen and Pedersen clear cuts. We got a clear cut of Darlene, clear cut of Kachuk, another Ethan Bear, a Marner clear cut, a Svechnikov jersey. Very nice. Rasmus Sandin auto. That is his rookie. And a Henry Yokoharu young gun. So that's from Instagram. Just some Timorin stuff, clear cuts. Guy was having a deal on it, so I decided just to buy. Okay, and this last one's from eBay. I just want to make sure there's no note in it. That has my name or my address on it. Oops. All right. Let's see what he sent. I have no idea what this is. Oh, this is... Uh, autograph I'm sending to PSA. Uh, do not open a case or investigate it. Not describe your damage because it makes it impossible for me to assist you personally. There you go. Uh, nice. And that is, I'm going to send to PSA. If you guys don't know, I collect autographs. That's a Dan Aykroyd certificate. JSA. Very nice. Dan Aykroyd index card. I am going to send that to PSA DNA. I have a few orders there. When that comes back, we will include that. And uh, we'll do a mail day of me opening that. I have a bunch of PSA cards coming, hopefully in the next week. They are stuck in the United States because of all the stuff going on. But guys, that's my mail day. I hope you guys like, subscribe, share, follow me on Instagram, follow me on Facebook. And hopefully tomorrow, Artifacts. If not, we're doing a sealed box retail or a upper deck. All right, guys, that's it. Have a good day. Have a good night. I'm the card collector, and I'm out.